We have a very humid air mass across northeast Indiana and northwest Ohio, and then we also have a system situated nearby acting as the trigger for showers and thunderstorms to develop this afternoon. We do stand a chance of still seeing an isolated strong to potentially severe thunderstorm with the main concern being damaging wind gusts. Of course, we've already had reports of some very heavy rainfall with some of these cells as they track northeastward across the region. So through the five and six o'clock hours, still going to maintain the potential for strong to severe thunderstorms again to main concerns, heavy downpours as well as some gusty winds and some of these have been packing some frequent lightning and small hail. Now the coverage and intensity, it does decrease right near sunset. As far as tonight's concern, it's going to be a very muggy night yet again. Overnight lows in the upper 60s and lower 70s, and we do see a chance of a passing isolated thunder shower. As far as coverage is concerned, it is going to be very limited. Now, the advertised boundary that's supposed to bring us some cooler and drier air, it's coming to us on Thursday. It's going to spark off a few showers and thunderstorms towards the middle of the morning through the middle of the day. Best opportunity will be along and south of US 24 towards lunchtime, and then in the afternoon, it all tapers off from the west to east and we should be dry later on in the evening hours and getting to enjoy some slightly more comfortable air, especially as we head into our Friday. So here's what it looks like for tomorrow. Very warm and muggy start to the day. 8 o'clock hour, low 70s. We're topping things out in the afternoon right near that 80 degree mark and then we have that cooler and drier air settling in.